My name is Levi Kirkman, General Manager for New Warner Farms. We have three finishing feedlots in Albion, where we run 27,000 head, Elgin, Nebraska, where we run 29,000 head, and our Spalding feedlot location, where we run 20,000 head. We farm 20,000 acres across four different counties, most of which are all in corn production. Those crops are harvested every fall to come into our feedlots. Here in New Orleans, we have a cattle first approach with the theory that what's best for the cattle ultimately is what's best for us. If we can take care of the cattle, they're gonna take care of us. We were first introduced to Lactapro as a cattle health product to use on um, cattle that we had treated that had maybe been off feed for longer than they should have been. After that, uh, drought and tight hay supplies and high hay prices led us back to expanding on Lactapro. And by utilizing Lactapro, we were able to cut our step-up program in half almost. Um, a traditional step-up period took 28 days for us. Um, on some of these high-performing yearling cattle, we were able to cut that down to 14, even 10 days in some instances. We were able to get them into their home pen faster, get them started on feed sooner. Here at New Warners, we have a cattle-first approach. Lactapro helps us accomplish that. By being able to decrease our step-up period, that resulted in fewer loads of, um, of lower rations that we had to feed or bulkier rations. Um, if cattle were on a ration three for seven days before, now they're on it for a three, three day period. That, that, those were less loads that we had to haul every day, um, which meant we were able to haul more loads of a highly concentrated uh, finisher ration, increasing our efficiencies and the cattle's efficiencies. I think our hay grinder was the first one to notice that we were using Lactapro because rather than grinding 300 bales every time he came here, he was grinding 150. So he was probably the happiest of it. As far as our feed truck drivers on the yard, they, they were probably the second ones to notice it. Um, rather than having to haul these bulky loads and travel around the yard to, to get to every little pen, our lower rations were more concentrated to one area of the feedlot, and the other areas were more of a finisher. It decreased our feeding time every day. It decreased our loading and batching time every day. This left more time for our employees to um, work, work on their trucks, work in other areas of the yard, and uh, have more time for themselves too. So by administering Lactapro NXT at that re-implant, we are able to keep those cattle on feed through that rehandling event. Uh, this has shown up for us in the form of uh, increased efficiency for the feed truck drivers, for the cattle, for the pen riders. Keeping our cattle healthy is of the utmost importance to us. Lactapro NXT has done a great job of decreasing our late day deads on some of our long day fed cattle. This is really important to us with the value of an animal uh, towards the end of the feeding period. We've invested uh, the purchase cost, 200 days of our time and our effort to get an animal that close to the finish line. Uh, we just want to see it succeed. Lactapro fits our operation very well. We were able to take that stressful event and by using Lactapro decrease uh, any stresses that may happen to the cattle in that time. By increasing the pH in the rumen and keeping that rumen functioning even while we're reprocessing these cattle. I would recommend Lactapro to any feed yard manager who is looking to improve the efficiency of their yard, um, provide more time, free time to their employees um, to do better for their cattle and to be able to decrease overall cost with those improved efficiencies. Here at New Warner Entities, we're a very diverse operation, so innovation is of the utmost importance to us. Um, Lactapro was a great way for us to implement uh, a form of innovation into how we feed cattle, to how we um, care for cattle, and to how we produce a high-quality product.